Race two of the Megan Trophy Eurocopsies, race one winner Bas Schotto starting from pole with Albert Costa second and Costa's teammate Nalio third. And as they go round the first corner, Nalio cuts the inside line on Costa, forcing him to drop back and Snurks in car 12 manages to slip round both of them into second place. Meanwhile, Jerome Schotthurst's moving up through the pack, here attacking Gilardoni. The battle for second place is a tough one as Nalio and Costa breathe down the neck of Snurks in car 12, while a little further back, Tuna goes for a spin. Nalio is on the attack and Costa sees the opportunity to slip through too but is a little too aggressive and is given a warning for the action. Costa and Nalio may be in the same team but the Spaniard and the Italian lose no love out on the track. They exchange places again but finally Nalio gets the upper hand and will stay in second place right till the end. Further back, Oliver Freemuth pays the price of being over-eager in passing Jerome Schotthorst, running off and also being hit with a 10-second penalty. Bas Schotthorst is alone out in the lead, and while Nalio makes up a few seconds with a faster pit stop than his Dutch rival, the status quo will remain until the finish line. The French-based TDS racing team celebrates a brilliant start to the season, victorious in both Megan Trophy Euro Cup races ahead of the Oregon team. It's Bas Schotthorst and TDS racing ahead of no less than four drivers of the Oregon team. If the car was really good and uh, we had an amazing pace, especially in the beginning. And I just uh, saw the others uh, disappear behind me. So, you know, that's the best feeling you can have on the racetrack. Schotthorst first, Nalio second and Costa third. Schotthorst thus largely leads the points table ahead of the other two Oregon team drivers who were on a level pegging together, each having taken a second and third place this weekend.